Welcome back to the stream. It is our favorite day of the week. It's Foodie Friday. This week we're checking out one of the latest instant cake misses to hit the shelves. And let's just say it's got a bit of a kick to it. Bit of a kick, bit of a chill. Right? We've depends. got a Jamaican founder here. Yeah, it right, depends. Depends on the flavoring. <laughs> uh, with us in studio to tell us about this elevated cake mix. Jamaica, explain. Uh, yes, no, this cake mix will quite literally get you high, which is why it is oh. only sold in dispensaries. Mm -hmm. um, but it's the first shelf stable cake mix with THC in the actual mix to make it two shelves in Illinois. And I got to sit down with the company who put it all together. The mix does contain sprinkles in it already, so you don't have to worry about adding sprinkles. At first glance, this looks like it could be any regular box of cake mix. I mean, I don't see any weed. Do you? Most people will use oils or they'll incorporate butters, but it's in the dry mix, so every bite is going to be the same. And each bite is going to pack a punch, with 50 milligrams of THC in every box. And Chef Chris Texera is the man giving Betty Crocker a run for her money. It's rich, it's decadent, it's been flying off the shelves. He works for the 5050 Restaurant Group. I'm super familiar with these products. I've been working on R&D for the group for the past 11 years. They own both Westtown Bakery, where Chef got his start, and OK Dispensaries, where Chef got his inspiration. It was just a natural progression that I would be the guy that kind of moved, took us from the restaurant side into the cannabis side on the food. What they've created is a pioneering product in the world of pot. So we're kind of the first of its kind where it's offering a shelf stable product that you can just take at home and with a couple of ingredients make it. Each of their three flavors comes with an infused mix and a nine by nine pan to cook up your extra special treats. You just need a couple of ingredients that you have at home, oil, vinegar, coffee, water, soy milk or any kind of dairy. Uh, and in 45 minutes, you can have everything ready to go. You can frost them, dust them in sugar or have them just as they are. Either way, they're using recipes that have withstood the test of time. We used the recipes that we have for the cakes at West Ham Bakery, so we knew we had the recipe. We just needed to make sure that we were going to have the right dosage. And because the bakery has come to be known for their vegan and gluten-free options, these cake mixes follow suit. Our cakes have been well known for the past 11 years, so we want to offer that same quality so that anyone that has a dietary restriction should be able to enjoy this still. So when you make these at home... It doesn't taste any different than if you were getting a cake from us. Right now, you only can get these mixes from them. OK Dispensary's two locations are the sole vendors. But Chef doesn't believe that it'll last for too much longer. Eventually, we think that we'll be able to do it uh, statewide and roll it out to all the dispensaries in Illinois. And they don't plan on stopping there. The 5050 Group is already brainstorming new infused products, most with a nostalgic bite. The next progression might be Rice Krispie treats, uh, might be, you know, some cinnamon rolls, it might be cookies. The sky's the limit. Taking customers back to being a kid through the best parts of being an adult. Their two newest flavors, Canafetti and Devil's Food Cake, just hit stores this week. And Chef says before they were even released, they were already flying off the shelves and had they had a ton of pre-orders. And it's really exciting to see that people are getting geared up for this incoming intersection between cannabis and food that really was kind of inevitable mm -hmm. once uh, legalization hit the state. Yeah, and you brought some samples for us live to, to, to test. Ed, we're going to yeah. have you sample the uh, uh, weed cake. <laughs> Just kidding. I have my I like own to fork. Keep my job. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We don't get HR involved. Uh, thank you, Jam. It's great seeing you. Another you. fantastic foodie Friday. Well, you're watching the stream here on CBS News Chicago.